good lord <laughs> welcome back to my channel welcome to another day in the life brought to you this morning for starters by myself and Dorothy it's Tuesday and I don't really know what's on the agenda for today apart from the fact that I've got to do the morning dog walk and Matty and I've got to take Dorothy to the vet at 10 to 10 for her second lot of jabs. But I also need to tidy this room today quite quite drastically. I need to make a start on changing some stuff in the office. I'm very gravelly this morning. I've woken up a little bit congested and a bit gravelly. So so yeah, um I just thought I'd bring you along for the day and we'll see we'll see how it pans out. This is the toy you're supposed to play with. This is a piece of cardboard. Yeah. Darcy Dinkum. Darcy. She's just met this dog. <laughs> You're a beautiful boy, aren't you? You are. She's <laughs> just watching the baby look. Like, Where you going, my baby? Look at his little face. <laughs> did you make a new friend? He's Darcy. A bit, he's a bit big for you. <laughs> Darcy, did you make a new friend? Oh, he's good.
And she was very, very pot bellied with, with the with she, um, yeah. issue, but then that's also yeah, gone she's now. still getting yeah, it sometimes. She woke up this morning and then pot bellied. Right. But of course, she's tiny, steady, isn't she? Yeah, so even when they're eating you. a lot, it can just show up, yeah. I am very much underachieving today. Um, Doris has had a nice long nap. I sat there next to her while she had a nice long nap just in case she needed company. I have, I have just cancelled molly's pet plan insurance and gone with another company because pet plan just keep increasing their prices year on year despite the fact that i haven't claimed so i've gone with another company and got exactly the same cover for half the price so um i have i have achieved that today but i need to go in the loft i went to the loft yesterday and got this mug down to post for a customer and it's the wrong one so i need to go to the loft and swap that um i don't really fit very well through the loft hatch anymore now i'm so bloody fat again so i never look forward to doing that but i need to do that i need to do some parcels um i really need to get some sorting out starting in this room as well for the big move which if you've seen my other video you'll know what i'm talking about and if you haven't you won't i got a bit sidetracked i'm trying to sort out these bags tammy and i are doing a car boot sale at the weekend to clear some stuff and i got sidetracked in sorting out what was what and um still need to go in the loft really I have created chaos. Total and utter chaos. I should not be allowed to touch things. We found a coat that just about fits her, but she's not loving it. Um, we are, Tammy's and I are going out for lunch, and Darcy is going to see Nat at work while we go for lunch. Very beautiful. We're at Nando's. We came to Nando's for lunch. My food has arrived. I've got butterfly chicken, mash and broccoli because I'm trying to be good. Tamsin, Tamsin's being really good. Tamsin's being so good, she's got no food at all. Mayonnaise. <laughs> Just mayo, all four of them. All four of them. Four mayos. <laughs> Tamsin, you've got food mm, coming, right? Yummy. <laughs> she has got food. Butterfly chicken, mac yeah. and cheese and chips. <laughs> You're not so serious. <laughs> tomorrow good slightly terrifying hair morning <laughs> um i realized that i didn't vlog much yesterday i had to go to work yesterday evening and so i thought i might as well carry on shouldn't be vlogging going down the stairs that's very dangerous i thought i'd carry on today um i have just had a shower and not done anything yet with my hair which is why my fringe looks quite so mental it's time to take the dogs out i'm going to get my boots on Take the dogs and meet Anthony at the park. There looks to be an awful lot of rainfall overnight, so I think we've got quite a lot of swamp. So, this is the water that you see in the park regularly. It's completely full all the way around. Bear in mind, there was not a drop of water here yesterday. This is the amount of rainfall we've had overnight that fills this runoff completely. I'm going to walk around and see how much... You, you, it's unbelievable. The amount of rainfall we've had in one night is crazy. I've got to try and get across this. <laughs> this is the narrowest spot, I think. If you hear a splosh, it'll either be you falling in or me. If it's a big splosh, it's me. Oh, I made it. <laughs> Bella, jump. Good girl. Morning, come. So yeah, this is one night's rainfall. It started raining about four o'clock yesterday. And by five o'clock, it was belting down. And it carried on belting down all night. And uh, when we get around here, you'll see just how how much there is. <laughs> it's crazy, the volume of rainfall we've had. I mean, it runs off, it runs off the top field. Have you heard me talk about the top field before? They built the top field up and levelled it. And since then, all the runoff comes down into here, which used to be a perfectly nice park with children's play stuff and all the rest of it. 
and uh, and now it looks like this. What usually happens is that first bit where we were a minute ago fills up, then this second part fills up, and eventually over a few days that part fills up. But as you can see, that has filled up in 12, 16 hours. Crazy, absolutely craziness. It is absolutely full to the brim. That bit there, see that, that concrete V-shape there? That's my bit of plumbing that I sit on usually. <laughs> I won't be sitting on that today. Molly's just run across it. <laughs> and the reason it fills up the way it does is because it has to go through that one tiny hole and then it's supposed to flow out through there and that's all horribly blocked and manky. So that's why it's... Uh, so over full, I'd love to know who designed this, love to. Pat on the back for whoever that was. This is the first time Ada has come to visit since Dorothy arrived. Oh yeah, you tell her Ada. Ada is just looking at Dorothy as if to go, what the hell are you? Dorothy pretty much looking at Ada the same way, what the hell are you? <laughs> You're very upright, girl. <laughs> you are very tense. There's no relaxation there, is there, today? No. <laughs> I'm not sure where they've come from, but she's now got mutton chops. My bedroom has to be changed around so that I can fit a desk in here ready for when Tammy moves in so Anthony and I are gonna see what we can achieve so now you see it now you don't okay stage one is done the bed is moved that was a lot of work and still a fair amount of work to deal with my plan was that my blanket box was going to fit down there and it's plainly not going to fit down there so we've got some thinking to do on that score. I may have to part with that, which would be a shame because I really love it. But uh, that's where we're at. It's getting better. Slowly but surely it's getting better. But it's still a bit, um, yeah, needs a bit of work. And I have to have a desk over there, so that's not staying. The blanket box, we've decided the blanket box is probably going to go into the storage unit. Okay, this is where the bedroom be at. Excuse the state of the bed, I just slid off it a moment ago. We're not, we're no, we are by no means done. But we are, I could go to bed tonight if I needed to, which I will need to. The office is an absolute shit show. Most of this is car boot stuff for the weekend. I need to pack my parcels and then we're trying to get and go out for a carvery. So I need to get all my parcels now.
Well, I've got eight out of 11 done. I might have time to do the rest when we come back after food, but I've got to go to work tonight, so we shall see. I am now thoroughly knackered and heading off to work. So that's another day done. The entire house is in disarray at the moment and uh, can't see it getting much better for a while yet. What with the new puppy and all the uh, movings around and stuff that's going on. So yeah, we've got to work for a bit of peace and quiet. Thank you for joining me for this very, very bitty vlog and I'll be back soon. Take care. Bye for now.